Good morning YouTube, welcome back to the vlog. This is the start of the Iceland vlogs. I'm at Bristol Airport. I have Lizzie with me. She's just dropped me off, which was really nice of her. So um, I'm gonna go into the airport and go through security and all that. Get into the duty-free lounge and all the lounges and all that and relax before going on the flight. So let's go through security. I'll see you when we're in uh, the lounge. So I've made it through security. I'm now in the airport lounge. Uh, I'm just uh, walking around. Uh, gate information at 6.25, so I've got about an hour and 50 minutes or so to wait. So I'm gonna go and get some stuff which I need, like uh, shower gel, shaver and all that, because I couldn't take any of it through. So I'm gonna go to WH Smith and have a look around. I might go to Starbucks as well and have a cheeky Starbucks. So let's go. So I've got all my stuff. Um, I've got my Starbucks. I stopped up at Starbucks, so I've got about an hour, uh, about an hour and twenty-five minutes to wait now. So, send my Starbucks, uh, look on my social media and all that stuff, sort some stuff out, um, plan my day ahead because I'm going to get into Iceland before I can check into my hotel. But I've already emailed the trip manager to see if I can leave my bags at the hotel, which I can. Um, so I might pop out and go for a little um, stroll around Reykjavik. I'm probably saying it completely wrong, but um, we'll see what we can do. Uh, but I'm definitely going to get there a bit early and uh, go and see the sights for a little while. So I have landed in Reykjavik. Here's the airport. Um, I'm just going to the toilet because I'm bursting for a pee. Flight wasn't too bad. Uh, just over two and a half hours, so not long. So uh, toilets, I've been bursting. I need to find the uh, express coach. So let's go and find it. So I'm out of the airport. I'm on the bus waiting to go to the hotel. Um, pretty nice airport it is. Um, hopefully get there in time to go out and have some food. So I wasn't expecting to get into my room so early, but um, yeah, it's a sharing room, so I don't know who I'm sharing with yet, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, it's got a telly, it's just a bog standard, cheap little hotel room. Shower, toilet, so it's a little cheap hotel. It's not even, it's not too bad actually. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna see what we can do, see what we can get up to. So I've just got checked into my hotel and I've got myself a subway and I'm going to eat it. So I've decided to come out for a little walk. I'm going to go up to the Sun Voyager, which I saw was one of the attractions here in Iceland. Uh, weather isn't too bad actually, it's not too cold. It is, I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but your breath does show up. But uh, yeah, it's not that cold and this is the uh, view. Uh, and all that it looks really nice and they'll definitely take some photos and all that so tonight we've got a meeting with the whole group with Kentucky um, then we've got dinner and then we're going out on a northern light hunt uh, they can't call it a tour because a tour means you're going to see it where the northern lights you d you might not get to see them so we've got two days of that just in case so hopefully um, we see them tonight which will be really cool because that's one of the things I want to go see um, walking in Iceland is quite hard because they drive on the other side of the road and in England they sort of left 
but now it's looked right. And every time I'm crossing the road, I'm looking the wrong way and they get run over. But yeah, I thought I'd come out for a little walk um, and hopefully go and see this sun voyager. I've got my sat nav on uh, and all that, so I shouldn't get lost and hopefully get back to the hotel for around about uh, one of, it's half one now. So hopefully get back to the hotel uh, for four when our meeting is. So I'll see you when we're at the Sun Voyager, if I get there. So I made it across the road. Uh, I'm here now, which looks really, really, really nice actually. Uh, my hotel is over there somewhere. So it was a mile walk to this Sun Voyager, which I can just see in the distance over there. So not far to go really. What am I zoomed in for? There we go, let's zoom out. So just in a nice little walk, because I've been sat on a plane all day and my legs need a little bit of a walk uh, and all that. So let's get walking. So I'm nearly at the Sun Voyager now. Um, I will let you know that I will be filming on both G7X and 70D while I'm here. Uh, probably tonight I'm just going to take the big 70D camera out just in case if we get to see the Northern Light but we're in a higher resolution than this uh, camera so um, I'll be filming on that tonight. Um, I'll be doing like slow-mo footages and all that. Also GoPro. I bought the small GoPro so I didn't have to carry all the box about and all that. So uh, yeah so I'm nearly there. Well another 200 yards 300 yards so yeah it's nice and chilly out here uh, the temperature at the moment is let me just show you it is at the moment minus one degrees so not cold uh, my legs are feeling a little bit at the top but that's good because my legs are cold it's uh, making my muscles a bit better so I can walk a bit longer so that's good uh, let's get to the Sun Voyager take some nice photos and then head back and relax for a little bit oh why am I so zoomed out come on camera zoom out zoom out zoom out zoom out here we go so we made it to the Sun Voyager, literally just there, a couple of metres away. Um, walk wasn't too bad actually, it was quite nice, just a nice little stroll along the, what do you call this, coast I'd say or something like that. So yeah, then I take a couple of photos there, get some good shots and uh, have a walk back, relax for a little bit in the hotel room and uh, go down and meet everyone on the tour. So here it is, here's the Sun Voyager. Uh, it's on the edge of the town. Uh, the most beautiful view there ever is of the water going out to the ocean, North Atlantic. Uh, but yeah, looks really good. Good morning YouTube, welcome back to today's vlog. Welcome back to day two of Iceland. Yesterday we went on a three hour northern light tour, didn't see anything, most of us slept on the coach. So today we're going on a golden circle tour. So I'm gonna swap between the G7X and the 70D, so um, I'll make sure, but um, I will try and get these videos uploaded for you. Hopefully tonight I'll start doing one for you. So uh, let's get ready to go down for breakfast. Stopped off for some lunch. I got myself a cheeseburger and some chips. Um, this morning the weather was really, really bad, so I couldn't bring out the camera as much because it was torrential rain, snowing, and windy, and the camera would have got fucked up. So um, the weather's changed a bit. It's still a bit raining, but um, it's a lot less pissing it down. So I'm gonna have some lunch, and then there are some hot springs over here which I'm going to go and have a walk around and then get back on the bus. That's going to be good. So, we have stopped off at the Lava Hot Springs, which is like little pods of water popping up from the ground. You can see, we are going to go a little bit closer and see all the water. 
there's one more oh, shoots up in the gone. air in a minute as well. But the temperature of this water is around 80 to 100 degrees. Ooh. As you can see, this water is all coming up and there's little pods over there if you see where you can get water shooting up. There is one down there which does shoot up as well so we're gonna have a little walk and see what we can do. So this um, hot spring one here is the one what shoots up as you can see um, it just did it I didn't have my camera ready so I'm gonna wait here with my camera on video uh, ready to get it it will be on the iPhone so I will insert that now if I do get it on that. So we've come to Arsenal and we are walking to see the waterfall which is down there on a different angle which is over there. So this is the waterfall from the top. I don't know if you can hear me that's why I'm shouting a bit louder. So here is the waterfall. Uh, so it was over on that platform but we've walked around and now we're here. The other waterfall is over there, uh, and that one looks amazing. As you can see, the water is running quite strong and all that, going into the glacier down the bottom. Do it. Do it. 